With the dead sensor pixel test, we are looking for pixels that are darker than normal, possibly stuck as solid black. Power on the camera with an SSD drive in it. Set the camera settings to the following. ISO equals 800. Set the recording settings to the following. Recording format equals 2.5K RAW, dynamic range equals film. Set the display settings to the following. Zebra equals 75%. Point the camera at a dim studio light with a diffuser on it. Set the lens aperture to as closed as possible. Turn on the light and set it to a mid-range dimming if adjustable. Now open the lens aperture slowly just until the entire camera display is filled with zebra lines. Record for one second or less, then stop recording. We only need one frame. Power off the camera, remove the SSD, and copy the first DNG file from the SSD to a computer. Launch Adobe Photoshop. Open the DNG file in Photoshop. Do not change the color grading or any import settings as we don't want to see sensor noise, just dead pixels. Set the image size to view, fit on screen. Select the magic wand tool in the toolbox, set tolerance to 30 and anti-aliasing to off. Click anywhere on the white image. The selection should be around the border only. There should be no pixels anywhere in the intersection of the image. If there are any dead pixels in the intersection, these may need to be edited out in any video taken with the camera. With the stuck sensor pixel test, we are looking for pixels that are brighter than normal, possibly stuck as solid white or red, green or blue. Power on the camera with an SSD drive in it. Set the camera settings to the following, ISO equals 800. Set the recording settings to the following. Recording format equals 2.5K RAW, dynamic range equals film. Place the lens cap over the lens. Record for one second or less, then stop recording. We only need one frame. Power off the camera, remove the SSD, and copy the first DNG file from the SSD to a computer. Launch Adobe Photoshop. Open the DNG file in Photoshop. Do not change the color grading or any import settings as we don't want to see sensor noise, just stuck pixels. Set the image size view, fit on screen. Select the magic wand tool in the toolbox, set tolerance to 30 and anti-aliasing to off. Click anywhere on the black image. The selection should be around the border only. There should be no pixels anywhere in the intersection of the image. If there are any stuck pixels in the intersection, these may need to be edited out in the video taken with the camera.